Hello everyone, welcome to QST Clinic's official channel, your trusted destination for hair transplant in India. Today we are thrilled to take you through an extraordinary journey of one of our patients who underwent a life-changing hair transplant surgery right here at QST. Allow me to introduce you to our patient, a 30-year-old gentleman who was struggling with grade 3 vertex baldness. While his hairline had receded drastically, he had fairly good density at the top of his head. However, he also experienced thinning in the crown region. Interestingly, his temples had natural density, so we focused our efforts on his affected areas. His donor area was dense, providing ample material to harvest the grafts we would need. Our expert doctor decided on a customized treatment plan tailored for him. The focus was on recreating a natural hairline that would complement his facial features. During this careful planning stage, we chose to use thin single hair grafts at the hairline zone, keeping it precisely 7.1 cm from the glabella point. This meticulous approach aimed for an optimal result that would age gracefully, elevating his frontal appearance. In the surgery, we harvested a total of 2,800 grafts. Single hair follicle grafts were used for the hairline and multiple follicle grafts were used to densify the frontal area. We took special care to avoid any future lines of demarcation and even address the thinning crown. All grafts were taken from the safe zones on the back and sides of his scalp. One month after the surgery, the patient came back for a PRP session. At this point, 90% of the transplanted hair had shed, which is completely normal. The donor area healed well and there was no sign of scarring. Before we proceed, if you find this video informative and valuable, please remember to like, share and subscribe to our channel for more amazing transformations and insights into the world of hair transplant surgery. Two months post-surgery, the shedding phase was ongoing but showing signs of new growth. It's worth noting that the rate of shedding can vary due to numerous growth factors and is completely natural at this age of the healing process. At the four-month mark, our patient began to see significant improvements. Not only was the growth noticeable in the crown area, but his donor side also showed incredible healing with no discernible scars. At this stage, we typically expect around 20% to 40% of new hair growth. What makes this stage particularly exciting is that the newly transplanted hair begins to thicken, giving a fuller appearance. 12 months post-surgery update. A year into the post-surgery journey, our patient walked into our clinic and his appearance was nothing short of remarkable. This is the phase where one can truly appreciate the results of a successful hair transplant as the hair has grown in fully, undergone natural cycles of shedding and regrowth and has been styled accordingly to the patient's preference. His frontal region boasted impressive density, perfectly blended with the existing hair, a testament to our meticulous planning and execution. At QST Clinic, we strive for excellence, using cutting-edge techniques for natural and undetectable results. Stay tuned for more updates on our patient's progress. Thank you for watching. If you or a loved one is grappling with hair loss, don't mask it with a cap. Reach out to us at QST Clinic. Your solution is just a consultation away. Don't miss your chance to transform your life. Make the right choice today with QST Clinic. Remember to like, share and subscribe for more such transformative journeys. Until next time, take care.